I have to say that it's an honor to present this award. Um, I did not get to meet Joyce because she was gone before I got a chance to come and join 1199. But when I got here, I met her spirit and a lot of people who were here. And this person clearly carries Joyce's spirit forward. The recipient of this award epitomizes what it means to be a union leader. She has stood by her co-workers through the good times and the bad, uniting her fellow workers in the face of layoffs and uncertainty about the possible closure of their shop. At the bargaining table, she led a triumphant fight against concessions, and her co-workers know her as a relentless advocate who never gives up. She's become famous at her workplace for her saying, this is a mountain I'm willing to die on. Beyond the four walls of her mental health facility, she reaches out to help other 1199 ers and other fellow workers. She's traveled from Cuyahoga County to Lorraine and Youngstown to walk picket lines for justice, even in cold and rain. This month, she drove for hours to stand in the vigil with the families of the 29 coal miners who died in the Upper Big Branch Mine disaster in West Virginia. She helps build our union in Cleveland with the backbone of a true Appalachian. And she keeps alive the humanity and the fighting spirit of our sister Joyce Lunsford. It is my honor and my privilege to present the Joyce Lunsford Award to my union sister, Barry Compton.